Hey everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core and uh, today we are going to discuss about uh, this uh, types of exception, exception message in uh, ASP.NET Core RESTful API. Uh, just when we hit that uh, get method, that is get endpoint, you can say that API, uh, gym API and just when we uh, execute it, that type of error message will be occurred. System not, uh, system dot not supported exception serialization and deserialization of system dot action instances are not supported path dot dollar sign move next action and uh, this types of action exception message serialization and deserialization of system dot action instances are required so uh, if you got that type of error message in your api system then you will say that you are using uh, in the repository in the repository you can say that uh, here you can say here we have in the repository section like uh, uh, that is the service so here we have a iGym service or iGym repository where I am using task taskable type or you can say that asynchronous programming but in the controller section gym API controller here I am just going to add a simple thing so that type of error message is occurred because uh, serialization and deserialization is occurred synchronous and asynchronous programming. So just to stop this and you can see that here I am just using asynchronous programming because the repository is used asynchronous. So that is asynchronous and just here I am using a wait and you can see that your problem will be fixed. According to the serialization and deserialization, that type of error message will be happened. So, so when we just call it, call it again and try it out and execute it. So you will notice that your response is 200 that success message display your total data of the gym and you can see that here we have a 200 success response and here we have it, your data okay so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net code